Let's listen to Bill Ackland as he reads from his book, Talking with God. The text for today is from Proverbs 18, verse 10. The name of the Lord is a mighty fortress. The righteous shelter there and are secure. And the prayer is about the providence of God. Dear Sustaining Heavenly Father, Today I want to thank you for your providential care in my life and in the lives of those especially dear to me. So many times your providence is unseen and unknown to us, but is working for your people in caring, in guiding, in directing, in preserving. And we think life is just as it should be, just as we want it to be, and dare I say, just as we think it ought to be. Being in an imperfect world, however, means that we should not make demands for favours that others seldom receive. Rather, we should be glad for what we do have, for a measure of life's good things each day, the best of which cannot be touched, for these are things of the spirit and the blessings of the heart. The events and experiences that stay right throughout our lives are providential touch points when heaven seems so much closer because you show you care and love us. Not sporadically, but even deeper as our lives unfold in the way you would have them to go. Never far below the surface of my recall is the crisis time in our family's life, when our car rolled several times, when we were bumped around inside before being flung out through the same door and deposited in the bush around us, not knowing where our three-month-old was or if he was even still alive. In a few moments we had skirted the car, and there he was, face down against the rear wheel, but not too damaged at all, except for the trauma of such an experience, for which he cried in shock for nearly a week. Our gratitude for answering my prayer, Lord, save us, cannot be put into words, but in a sense that doesn't matter, you read our minds where the gratitude is deeply embedded. I also recall a serious illness of my childhood, dengue fever, of learning to walk again when well enough, when another outcome was a real possibility. Providence, not chance, I believe was evident when my dear one and I met in the late 1950s, when God knew I needed someone sensible and good. Attractive was a bonus blessing. Someone who would be a good wife, an insightful and caring mother, and years later, just the right ma for our three grandchildren. I cannot speak of what is unknown to me, dear Lord, but I am sure that every day Providence is working on my behalf, designed to produce an outcome that pleases you and bring the greatest blessing to your people an eternal home in your presence. Providence will then be revealed in another sense and your sustaining power will mean what is impossible here will be a daily experience in that better world. Thank you, Lord, for your loving care. In our dear Lord Jesus' name I pray. Amen. To obtain your copy of Talking With God, written by Bill Ackland, give us a call in Australia on 02 4973 3456 or send an email to radio at 3abnaustralia.org.au.